What's going on, fellow A plusers? It's your boy Adam Perez. We're back, baby, once again with a brand new date in regards to Star Wars. That's right. We got ourselves a brand new Star Wars announcement that was made earlier today by Lucasfilm. First off, I apologize if my voice sounds a little bit hoarse. I feel like I've been losing my voice over the past couple of days. The weather change allergies are really kicking my ass right now, but I had to come on here and talk about this because you guys know I'm a big Star Wars fanboy. and anytime Lucasfilm announces a brand new project, I am certainly there to go ahead and check it out for myself. So I was really thrilled to come to find out that when it comes to the next Star Wars film that we're going to be getting, it's going to be starting our fantastic duo, none other than the Mandalorian and Grogu himself. That's right. This is one of the concept art pieces that they dropped today upon this news and this uh, release of information to let us know that when it comes to uh, Mando and Grogu, their next adventure that we're going to be seeing will in fact be on the big screen. That's right. The big screen. And it doesn't come is a surprise to me because I honestly feel like there have been like a rumblings of this possibly happening ever since like season three was kind of coming together. Uh, the idea of are we going to see them on screen is one of the seasons going to be turned into sort of a movie sort of thing. So it, it sounds as though those rumblings certainly came to fruition. I don't know if they were ever true originally or if they were just rumors that eventually became fact. Who certainly knows? But Lucasfilm today announces that the Mandalorian and Grogu will in fact be getting themselves a brand new movie and it's titled The Mandalorian and Grogu. So just to go ahead and give you guys um the full information you guys know how i like to do around here man i like to make sure that you guys see the sources for yourself so you have an idea as to exactly what is said how it's said so there's no misinterpretation so this actually came to me from starwars.com's website today you get to see them highlighting the concept art that we just showed you as well but it says the mandalorian and grogu journeys to the big screen um the mandalorian and grogu are embarking on a new adventure uh directly Directed by John Favreau and produced by uh, Favreau, Kathleen Kennedy, and Dave Filoni. Uh, the production will go into effect this year, 2024. So uh, it feels very much like they're pretty far along, honestly. Um, if you're showing us concept art, this clearly means that you've been working on it for quite some time. Um, and it also says, look, this is from Favreau himself. I have loved telling stories set in the rich world that George Lucas created, said Favreau. The prospect of bringing the Mandalorian and his apprentice Grogu to the big screen is extremely exciting. John Favreau and Dave Filoni have ushered into Star Wars two new and beloved characters and this new story is a perfect fit for the big screen this is what kathleen kennedy says president of lucasfilm so fascinating that they clarify the idea that it's directed by john favreau they haven't necessarily given us an actual writer that's attached to it now for the most part i do believe that john favreau has been doing most of the writing as well for mandalorian with um throwing in a couple of different directors from time to time and things like that but it seems as though he's ready to go ahead and helm this project directing wise for himself so i'm under the assumption he's going to go ahead and write this as well but he's clearly directing it the mandalorian and grogu will lead that's right lead lucasfilm's ongoing feature development slate including films already helmed by charmine obey chinoy james mangold and dave filoni which mind you and i love it though this little tidbit at the very end is currently developing ahsoka season two so that's a whole nother video in and of itself certainly right there uh, but this goes to show you that look those previous um, movies that were announced by Kathleen Kennedy last year, the James Mangold, Dave Filoni, and Charmaine Obey Chinoy, those are still going full steam ahead, if you will. Those are certainly still in the play. Um, they're not canceling any of those for The Mandalorian and Grogu, but the fact that it states it will lead this feature developmental slate and going um, beginning production this year, to me tells me they've got so much of this particular film sort of, I don't want to say done when it comes to like early development, pre-production and things like that. Uh, again, if we already get in concept, maybe they have storyboards, maybe John Favreau already has a script. If there is a question, if there is a question that I certainly might have in regards to this, the only question that I would have is, is this going to replace season four of 
uh, The Mandalorian, or is this technically season four script kind of molded now into for the big screen, the story being told there instead of on television? Or will this movie come out and then within a year or two after we still get ourselves an upcoming Mandalorian season four? Who certainly knows? I do wish that they would have clarified that a little bit. Doesn't give any mention of Pedro Pascal if he's certainly coming back. Uh, look, the guy's going to be under a helmet most of the time, uh, if anything. So I would be curious if with all the crazy casting and things that he already has to certainly worry about when it comes to other projects, will he have time to certainly tackle something like this? But again, if this was originally scheduled to be season four, but now they're taking that place to go ahead and make this movie, uh, maybe Pedro will certainly be made available. But um, a lot of great development here, guys, if you ask me when it comes to uh, this movie. Uh, you know, I'm, I know a lot of people, I've seen already a couple of people on Twitter like, I'll, I'll see it when I believe it sort of thing. You know, there is a part of me that's got to believe Believe, that's got to believe that Lucasfilm, especially with Bob Iger coming back, is got to be in the mindset of we are not going to announce anything until we are very certain that it's going to happen. Unless we literally have pre-production kind of already working and in place sort of thing and ready to go, uh, we're not going to make sort of any announcements. That's what I'm hoping Lucasfilm has certainly learned from their certainly their past struggles. Um, but when you got the excitement of John Favreau and The Mandalorian, and what they're doing there already in their first three seasons. I think a lot of us certainly want to see this duo certainly on the big screen. Uh, there's some certainly some loose ends for them to explore after season three, but I think this is a great move uh, to go ahead and have some established characters that fans really enjoy so far if they've been following Star Wars television. Uh, and I think this could be a really big win if uh, put together very, very well. And look, I trust Jon Favreau when it comes to his films uh, and what he's been able to do with these characters. So I'm very much much looking forward to it guys but look i want to know your thoughts the mandalorian and grogu set to go ahead and go into production this year to go ahead and be the first that's right the first brand new star wars film that we get certainly ahead of the other three that kathleen kennedy has announced what's your excitement level for this once we get brand new information and further details we'll definitely continue to keep you guys updated if not in its own solo video check us every sunday live for a brand new episode of a plus hero report we'll certainly break down more news for you guys but until then do me a big favor as always guys take care of yourselves take care of each other and keep it a plus i'll talk to you later bye